Alright guys, put on a happy face. No, that doesn't come before 7 o'clock in the morning. They can't, like the video quality always looks really weird here in the morning before the dark. sun sun actually comes out. But uh, Eric and I are at a church sale in the warm car. It is 37 degrees outside. The yard sale starts at 7 and it is 6.30. One person already in line, so we're, we're not going to be first. <laughs> but it's okay because I'm nice and toasty. Um, but yeah, we're going to be heading in here. Well, we'll probably be getting in line here in a couple minutes, actually. It looks like um, he's regretting his decision yeah, to get oh, out so soon. Oh, I know he is <laughs> so like freezing. 37 outside. Absolutely freezing. But um, yeah, this is a pretty, pretty big church um, yard sale, so... Um, I'm excited. Sometimes we find stuff here. Sometimes we don't find so much, but um, we're gonna probably get in line here in a couple minutes. So wish us luck that we find some stuff. Come on in. Good morning. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. Oh, franticness Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. is coming. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. Hello. Look at all these perfume bottles. Don't think, Michelle. Just buy them all. <laughs> Here's another one of those kind of scaredy cat planters. Just sold a pink one like that. I like this tray here. Oh wow, check out this Lennox set. It's Disney. They do have 10 on that. I'm not sure if that's worth it or not. I'm gonna pass on that, at least for now. Maybe I'll come back to it if it's still there. That is false craft. This dish set's pretty. <laughs> oh, these are cute. Look at those. Five dollars for the set there. Hmm. I'm gonna debate those two if they're still here when I come back around. She's made out of some sort of stone, art stone by Carson. Ten dollars for this dog set. It's cute. Whoa, what's this guy? Mm, no, not anything too fantastic there. Do we see anything else down here? We got ten dollars on that. What do you think? I'm not sure. This looks like a pottery vase. It does glow. Is that like a cake stand or cake? Not a, not a, not a, not a cake stand, a cake plate. <laughs> That's up to you, Eric. You can put it in the bag and we'll decide. Santa guy. Um, let's see. It's this little hanging thing. Oh, this is a stockinette doll. She's kind of attached to a base. I wish she wasn't attached to something. <laughs> oh, look at these. Get those for my dog. I feel like she would completely destroy these pieces, like actually tear them off. So 
Might pass on those. I tend to get her like the BarkBox toys when I see them. She has a subscription to BarkBox, but that's a Gord Santa. I think I'm gonna pass on him though, I think. I'm not feeling his feet. They're like very loose, loosely glued on, I should say. Um, I'm not really looking at the bottom of the table, so I need to do that. This is a cute Easter tree for $3 with all of the wood mini ornaments. That would be cute, the booth next Easter. I'll have to decide. Oh, here's a little plastic blow mold Santa for 50 cents. I'll grab him. He's very lightweight. I thought maybe he'd be like a thicker wood, like a heavier wood, but don't really feel this is marked Japan it does have some paint loss though uh, I'm not sure if I'm feeling that guy oh look Eric found bluebirds of happiness oh do you see he found some melted popcorn too Eric's finding some good stuff yay okay let me know if you need help with anything else. Bag. Yep. Always afraid they won't work. Yeah, I know. All right, we'll just try down this side. Let's take a look over here too. It's getting getting a little crowded in here. This. Like that. Um, what are those little chairs? Little pin cushions. Interesting. Some styrofoam rabbit. Bunch of linens over there. I don't really feel like looking through linens right now. Okay, let's go someplace we haven't been. Go over here. Go down these aisles. I like these glasses here. Are these like peanut butter glasses? Not sure how much those are. Those are pretty though. These are pretty too. I brought my lights so I could zap Crackle, them. crackle glass. These are probably pure wine or something. Maybe. Look at these. Little piggy salt and pepper shakers. What's this guy here? Just a little team hot. Oh, there's temptations. <laughs> had one of these in the booth. I don't think that it sold though. At least I don't remember if it did. All right, now I'm stuck in here. I need to get out of this section. I don't think I can backtrack. We're backtracking to get out. Otherwise, we're never gonna get out of this aisle. <laughs> we're backtracking, we're backtracking. Okay. I wanted to take a look at some of the toys over here. That looks like some older, like 90s Barbie accessories or something. Whoa. This looks like a caboodle. Oh, here's an old diaper bag. Oh no! Oh, I'll have to go pick that up on that side. Oh, thank you so much. 
to get this. Kids don't even that. Some vintage diaper bags can do okay. Um, so I'm gonna grab that. It also has like a nice pastel kind of color. Wish it were a little bigger, but not complaining. Oh, here's one of those cupcake dolls. She's missing her hat. All right. Um, is there anything down here? What in the heck? Oh my God, look at that thing. It's really weird. There's definitely some older stuff mixed in here. Like, look at that. He's precious. Mm. I'm like, do I want to get him to put in the booth at Easter time? Maybe. Okay. I also see, like, this looks like a puff-a-lump of some sort. He's neat. He's definitely older. Fisher Price. I'm going to grab him. It's kind of weird. This, um, this tote kind of has a smelly, smelly odor. I don't know if it's like the plastic of these old toys or what, but it does not smell pleasant. Let's see what's in here. Like, what is this? It's like a witch hat. Oh, look, here's some Annalise. Oh my God. Yeah, we'll take those. I don't know how much they are, but they'll be perfect for um, they'll be perfect for Thanksgiving in the booth. So grab those. That's why you gotta dig in boxes <laughs> where no one's been yet. Okay. All right, those look like blocks, mainly. Um, looks like a bowling set. So let's go over on the other side, if we can. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the Marvel Girls. I know. The Marvel Kim. Girls. I'm Kim. Yeah. Don't listen to Young Girls here tonight. <laughs> Good to see you. Beautiful as ever. Oh, those are cute. Alright, I just did a quick look of those because they're by the brand Tomy, which sometimes that brand of toys especially, like vintage toys, can do pretty well. Um, but that was not a good one. Is this something you put on like the side of a crib maybe? That is so stinking cute. I love Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this sloth. I think he does something, I'm not quite sure what. Take a look in here, make sure there's no more Annalise hiding. It's weird to see that they were in like just a stuffed animal tote, you know? guys. Those are Clarks. Of course they're Clarks. Clarks make such cute shoes. But the resale value just isn't quite there anymore in my opinion. Let's see if Eric's finding anything else down here. I feel like there was something I was kind of hemming and hawing over here. But I can't I don't think it's here anymore because it's not popping out at me, which is fine. Okay. Some jewelry. What did you get? Oh, that's what I was looking at. I was gonna look those up and then I walked past them. I didn't get a chance to look them back up. There's still a little room there. Okay. So Eric grabbed what I was hemming and hawing. I was like, oh, they're not there anymore. So it's okay. But unbeknownst to me, he picked them up. You see the blue 
<laughs> yeah, I did. I did. Yeah, I did see those. That was a great. Oh, here's another perfume. I grabbed like every single perfume bottle that I found. I feel like I'm being. Oh wow! I I need a certificate of authenticity with that. <laughs> no, I was saying like I did take all of the perfume bottles. It makes me feel a little bit greedy, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I took them all. That's a little Avon jug. The guy that's usually here for jewelry never showed up today, so maybe I'll take a look this time. Because <laughs> typically, like, he kind of runs through it. Are these... Okay, these cannot be earrings. Look at those. The backs on them. So what are they for? Are they kind of like hat pins, maybe? They're really pretty, very sharp on the backs without a um, backing on it. Uh, okay, Dukes. I'm not really seeing anything else on this table that's drawing my interest, so we shall move on. I did just notice this uh, princess house lamp on this table. It's $5. It's actually in really clean condition, which is nice, so I don't have to do much cleaning with it. Um, these do sell decently, but I actually had Eric buy one at the auction. Um, I haven't had a chance to get it in the booth or anything yet, but I do. I am going to put this in the booth. Do you have another one? <laughs> Didn't you win one at the auction, or did you I'm not, not win sure. it? I don't think I won it. Oh, he doesn't think he won it, so I'm definitely going to pick this we one up. We don't even know what we won. That's <laughs> <laughs> Stumbled upon this um, buffalo check Woolrich duck. I'm not quite sure exactly what it's supposed to be. Eric's looking it up to see if it's worth picking up. What are you seeing, Eric? Anything? I'm looking. He's looking. <laughs> There's no, none are hey, selling. Hey, what's that pea buckley moss right there? None are selling. None are selling. It's a pillow. It's a pillow. Pea buckley moss pillow. Pea Buckley Moss. <laughs> right? <laughs> Pea Buckley Moss. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's not what that's they're doing. Funny. <laughs> yeah. Um, does it say how much pillows are? I don't even see pillows on that chart up there. Huh. All right, guys. Eric went back into the church sale to pick up a breakfast sandwich. I'm probably just going to get a coffee at Duncan on the way home. So I didn't really want anything, but we are done here at the church sale. I don't even know what we spent. My bag was $50 and I don't know what Eric's bag was. Um, they did charge me $10 a piece on the Annalie, uh, Thanksgiving dolls, but I just went ahead and bought them because if we were at the auction, I'd, honestly be paying more than that um so <laughs> that's that um but i do think that we found uh some really nice things today so i'm excited about our find i hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know what you thought down in the comments and i will see you next time